Kari Jamaluddin has questioned the delay in action against DAP Chairperson Lim Guan Eng, while caretaker Kedah Menteri Basar Muhammad Sanusi Madnor faced swift action for his remarks touching on 3R issues. In an episode of his Keluar Skaja podcast yesterday, he stressed that they did not condone any remarks that touch on 3R and if Sanusi's speech was found to be seditious, let the due process of law take place. He also concurred with a remark by his co-host Shahril Hamdan, who said the law should equally apply to all, including against Lim Guan Eng, whose remarks also touched on 3R issues. I uh, sebab tu salah seorang daripada ahli politik generasi muda yang sudah pun menjadi ahli politik yeah. antara favorite kita uh, Dr yes. Akmal uh, ketua pemuda AMNO yeah. telah keluarkan yeah, kenyataan satu-satunya yeah. saya nampak yeah, I think he's the only one yeah. lah dia keluarkan kenyataan yes. dia kata where is the action on Guan Eng sebab Correct. kalau 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 betul dan kita akan serah kepada mahkamah Sanusi telah langgar one of the three Rs iaitu raja-raja Guan Eng telah langgar two of the three Rs race and religion yeah. Ya, yeah. yeah. jadi yeah. Uh, kita nak melihat uh, betapa konsisten tindakan daripada uh, Wan uh, siasatan dan juga tuduhan uh, daripada jabatan peguam negara. Putting the issue in context, Kairi said it may seem that the charges against Sanusi were politically motivated since he's the biggest threat to Pakatan Harapan in the August 12th state polls. Lim is currently under probe for allegedly claiming that Perikatan National would destroy Buddhist temples in Penang should they come to power in the upcoming state elections. The former finance minister has repeatedly denied making the claim on July 7th, clarifying that his speech was made in reference to a case of a Hindu temple in Kedah being demolished in July 2020. Last week, Inspector General of Police Razaruddin Hussein confirmed that the probe against Lim was almost done.